Okay, good morning. I ended up making um, a cup of tea versus a cup of coffee. <laughs> I realized I've already had four or five cups of coffee today. It's not noon yet, so I could have had another cup of coffee, but I decided to go for tea instead. We have Post Crossing, which I've already registered, and we have Pen Friends. Do -do -do -do. We'll do post crossing first. And so for post crossing, I think we had a couple from Germany. This one's from Germany. Oh, they wrote a lot. Let me. So this one was from Germany. Uh, the postage stamp on it is the post crossing stamp that Germany issued. And Yoda. I could collect, I love Star Wars cards. Um, and this one's from, clearly from, if you can see up here on the top here, it's clearly from a book where they have a, like a book pack of them or found this from a book pack of them. If you hear sniffing in the background, it's cause Duncan keeps sniffing. I don't know what he's hoping to find. He's been fed, he's had treats, he's had playtime. They've been out to potty. I think he just needs to settle. Uh, but I really, I really enjoy Star Wars and Lord of the Rings cards. And so thank you to Susanna for that lovely Yoda card. Yoda best. And then next up, do I only have, probably do the two animal cards here. This one I believe was from Belarus. Nope, I am wrong. This one was another one from Germany. And look at that gorgeous polar bear. I love the artwork, thank you. And the little pig. Is this from a story of some sort? I don't know, maybe it is. Let's see. Oh, I can use the little guy this time. So there's the postage stamps from this one. Ooh, hot. Hey, guess what? When you boil water and make fresh tea, it's hot. Uh, I like their Marvel postage stamps and then like this message in the bottle one too. I think this, I'm gonna see how many other ones of those ones I have received. So thank you. This was from, I don't know, Uta. Thank you, Uta, for this lovely card. Uh, next up, we have some penguins and the penguins are again from Germany, another one. And look at this one. Different sort of letter, letters. Oh, I wonder if it's the same pack. One second, taking a look here. Maybe it's the same set. Can you, yeah, you can see. Hmm. Uncertain. But I like those stamps. And then the penguins. Penguins are my favorite animals, along with platypus. I love birds too, so along with like ravens and crows. I feel like it might be easier to say which animal I don't like all that much. Horses, I feel like horses are overrated and over idolized too. I was never really a big horse fan. This one came in from the US. Uh, capital District, it says. Um, so this is, it looks like a Canva card. I think this is a Canva pre-made, homemade card. Right. Thank you to Nikki for that one. Then this card came in from Belarus. A postage stamp is a tiny little thing. And they sent me a, look at that cancellation though. I'm making sure it's on here. So tiny little postage stamp with a lovely cancellation. And they sent a lovely recipe and I don't have to um, translate this one. So that's really nice, thank you. I don't mind translating, FYI. If you do send me a recipe postcard, I don't mind having to translate, I'll do my best. Oh, this one's really sweet, thank you. This looks good too. Just boiled potatoes and um, bacon. 
do some steamed broccoli with it and you got yourself a meal. Okay, and so this is one letter from Caitlin. A second little letter from Caitlin. Oh, hi. You wanna come up and say hi? Duncan, you wanna come here and say hi? You wanna say hi? No? Oh, oh, here we go. Come here, say hi. Get your nose in there. Oh yeah, oh look, I'm a big dog. I get my nose in here, I say hi. All right, see, I'm just talking to nobody, basically. I'm talking to the interwebs, but I'm not talking to anybody in specific, or specifically. No, you wanna, you wanna, <clears throat> look at these paws, guys. All right, you gotta get down. You gotta get down. No, get down. <gasps> That's a good job. Good down, good down. All right, go lay down somewhere and chill out. Hi, Marvin, you wanna say hi too? Come here, Marvin. No, Duncan, Marvin. Marvin, come say hi. Duncan got to say hi. Come on, Marvin. There you go. All right, you wanna come up here? Say hi. Ooh. What's everybody saying? Hi, look over here. Ooh, I don't know how much you're on. Maybe you're on a little bit. Yeah, all right, all right, you're a good boy. Ooh, hello, internet. My Duncan is eating my back legs. All right, Marvin, you ready to get down? Duncan, you gotta stop eating his legs. Come on. All right, you guys made an appearance. Good job, good job. Mm -hmm. You made an appearance, now you gotta get down. Marvin, get down. You're worse than your big brother. By big brother, I mean little brother. Come on, get down. Good job. Okay, sorry for that. Actually, no, I, I did it on purpose, so. You're welcome for that. Um. Oh, this came in, this card came in from Finland. This is actually a postcard. Thank you so much. Um, let me make sure I get you. Is it Merja? Merja? Maria? Mary? I am sorry if I'm saying your name incorrectly. Um, I'm going to say Maria. I don't know why I want to say Maria. It might be incorrect. I will send you, I thank you for sending this card after you watched my, <laughs> watched my video with the Moomin card. I would love to swap and it is so cool. You were able to visit the Moomin Museum. That was almost a tongue twister. Maria visited the Moomin Museum. <laughs> I wonder if I can find an M word instead of visited. And they're all M's. Anyway, thank you for your postcard, I believe. Is it, oh, it might be Marianne, Marjan. But anyway, she also sent this little note paper um, with her address on it, it's note paper. I think you can see. And so I will get you something sent back. So that was one of the postcards. I don't, were there any other letters? There was another um, card here. I had a Halloween card from Kelly that I will need to reply to. And I think that was all the note cards. And then it was postcard. And then I got this other postcard from Shannon in this envelope. Which I wasn't so sure why, but anyway. Oh yeah, and I made a big, big mess of it. Let me open this. Okay. This beautiful card, look at this. It's gorgeous print they found she found then I know her address is on here it usually is happy fall it's my favorite time of year wish it lasted a bit longer in Alabama hope recovery from surgery isn't too rough and it's the Thurman fall farm tours um, on Thurman New York for October 7th that is very cute. Another one of her pictorial postmark fun postcards. And it came in a little US commemoratives envelope. I don't know why they did that. They keep shipping them in different ways because I believe when Shannon does the um, 
here I'll do let me cover for a dress so when Shannon does the the post is these specific postmarks that she's getting done on these postcards she has to send a has to send the postcard with the appropriate amount of postage to a USPS specific site one of the buildings I think there's a like one or three places to, and then write a note requesting I want X postmark and then after that they ship them to me the sender and so she doesn't see them again they get shipped off to this place to get the po pictorial postmark and then they ship it off to me I believe I may be wrong I'm but I believe that is the process and so she just has to let them know like I want this done on this card and then it gets done I will have to do that eventually. Right now, I'm, I think that's above my capabilities. Not capability, capacity. That's the word I want. It's above my capacity. Uh, the Nicole Parks, thank you for yours. I adore your, <laughs> thank you, Nicole. I'm glad that they're calming. I'm going to have to find you. And your handwriting is gorgeous, by the way. Love all the postage stamps. I love your handwriting. Thank you. And then it's this gorgeous, cute little dragon in tea. This reminds me of this um, book series I just read. That was a cozy murder mystery. But it was, it's based in England and it's got dragons in it. And there's dragons always drinking tea and solving crimes with little old ladies. <laughs> it's the old like women's society of the town. I'll have to remember what that book series is called, but this is adorable, thank you. And then this wonderful postcard Look at this. I love square postcards. This is from Tiago in Brazil. And he sent this with a lovely cancellation and post stamp. I don't think I have this postage stamp from Brazil yet. So thank you. Um, I need to send a reply to him. I also still have my stack that I need to send a reply to from last week that I just didn't get around to. I started work this last week and because I started work this last week, I have just been so much more tired than I have been. Um, but still recovering as well as uh, that. So those are the cards. I have one other thing to show from my pen friend, Caitlin, who is a bit naughty. Okay, good, we're on 16 minutes, so we're not too bad. So she sent me a big old package, and I'm gonna make sure that, and Caitlin, just so you know, I'm chuckling away with the fact that I just said package, that had, and I, it's a little bit disorganized now, but it had this envelope in it that contained all these little goodies here. Um, Cause she's recently, her birthday's in October and I didn't send her nearly enough stuff for her birthday. I'm terrible at, I'm not terrible. I'm just not the best at keeping on top of people's birthdays. I've never been good at it. And I try and I try and I fail miserably. So I just set the expectation up of, I send you stuff throughout the year. I really do try for the birthday though. I sent her something really late and I'll probably have to send her a birthday card too. But anyway, I digress. <sighs> Deep breath. Okay, so she sent me the grand opening bingo of this Middleburg Brooks with a bookmark and some stickers. And I got this coffee stuff from her, from her favorite coffee places. Uh, Waterford again. Um, I think the Waterford's so cute. We have this something bird. What is it? Rare bird. 
coffee roasters, another rare bird, coffee roasters, parsonage handmade soaps, I think my hand's in the way, the Waterford, and that was your fair, the Waterford Fair. It's a fall fest she goes to, and it's the one with a really cute post office that I shared the postcard of last week. Some Earth Essential stickers, another cute business card, like little watercolors, and then more rare bird coffee roasters, and then Earth Essentials. And then that, she had sent some stickers with it. I love these stickers. The things in bottles always make me so happy. And then a cute card and some open book chocolates. And she said she got the last one of the Jane Austen. But what I find delicious about this one is look at this, it's Pride and Prejudice. The sun's really coming in now. Uh, it's Pride and Prejudice, but this sounds good. Black currant and cinnamon and dark chocolate. They have the raven. These are very cute. Oh, they have um, Alice in Wonderland. The little princess sounds good. And then dark chocolate. Oh, that sounds interesting. The Count of Monte Cristo, the porcini mushrooms and peach and dark chocolate. I'd try that. Ooh, The Great Gatsby, mm, mint julep and dark chocolate. The Call of Cthulhu. These are so unique, I love them. I would try them all. I would try every single one of them. Huh, so thank you. <laughs> all that to say, thank you. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to trying that. Okay, so that was that and then the star of the show and oh my goodness i've already said thank you to caitlin and squealed over this the best that i can squeal lovely galen leather pin kaweco sport pen holder look at like what i just i was so surprised this is such a generous gift to give. So thank you again. And look at how beautiful and how cute. Is this, is this coming through? Can you see this? Yes, you can. Okay, good, good. And it has this cute flap in the middle. I've already put some pins in their new home and they are very happy, I must say. Look at this, beautiful, beautiful. And I've already got my pins in their home. We have the frosted ones here, and then I have the lavender, the iridescent, the, this was my first one of the Kaweco Sports, and then this is my favorite one. Um, all of them write very nicely though, but this one just, it's the aluminum uh, in this teal, and it's probably my favorite. It writes, it has the best weight. So before this goes too far into it being a pin video, which it should not, this is the gift that my friend gave me for her birthday, apparently. <laughs> but oh my goodness. So I already have some. Yeah. Come on then. There we go. I already have ideas. I have one empty spot. So we're gonna see who fills in that spot. And then I have this whole other side I get to fill up. And yes, I know. Who needs that many Kaweco sports? but aren't they cute? She did inspire me to get holders like this to better store my pins. And so I will be looking for one for my normal sized pins, like my Twisbees and Lammies. So Caitlin, again, thank you. I, I love that it also matches my traveler's journal. My, uh, diner version of it same feel and everything same sort of color and this one will change color as i use it might even get darker like this has um thank you i have no words other than thank you and i stared at it in just 
excitement and astonishment that you would be so generous. Oh man, I am still just, thank you. Ooh, that's fun. See, it does darken. Ooh, I should probably stop that. Okay, don't ruin it, don't ruin it, don't ruin it. So that is our mail for today. Where'd the rest of it go? I have a recipe I need to make and cards I need to reply to, as well as last week's cards. I still have all of you to reply to. And so that will be my day today. Thank you and thank you for watching. You take care of yourself. Keep healthy. If you want to be healthy, that is. I mean, healthy is a choice and if you want to. You stay, stay well, take care of yourself, like I've already said. I never know how to say goodbye, so I'm always a little bit awkward with that. But, bye for now. Oh, so gorgeous. I'm just gonna, just gonna leave this on the screen. Bye for now, you take care, and remember you are a valuable human being.